a pair of maybe pound smaller ones here in the pen. Uh, the one we're going to talk about first is going to be 69-10. Uh, She's kind of the, the off-belted guild on both sides, or I guess the double half belt, or however you want to describe that one, uh, uh, but the one here closest to the wall. Yeah, another good-looking one, uh, getting a little smaller on pa <clears throat> on pounds for the group. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, good-looking one out of her front end, awesome length in front of her blade with the right kind of skull shape and jawline. Uh, really like the turn to her center uh, center uh, rib cage and the body shape she's got very flexible spine with the extra good kind of shape down her top and a very square kind of a stifle uh, going directly away from you and again for the size she is I mean that's a heavy structure little gilded very good and stout on her pasterns and and uh, just correct in her proportions and her build uh, and again um, you know she's not very big but that one uh, that one can hit that dual purpose uh, thing real easy uh, she's uh, very good looking very shapely plenty of muscle for the market side of it plenty of structure for the breeding side of it she'll be fun for a long long time yeah i, I think that's a neat pig these 69s are very very deep litter of them i, I was kind of telling jim here these are full sibs of the 13s in our february sale and those uh, both of those uh, uh both of these would be gilt litters they both uh, laid down and had 17 and i think ween both weaned like 14 of them and uh, just awesome litters of pigs and this one i think falls right in line shapely back that's a big hind leg for for all the bigger she is a neat head and uh she's another one too i kind of said maybe on a couple other ones uh, the uh, we would have sold the the reserve of all guilt there at winter national and perry out of our april sale last year to me that one just kind of looks like the kind you can have fun with this fall but i think can can and truthfully end uh, end her show career in 2025 and, and do it uh, in a very competitive type of way that's 69-10 crossbred guilt